An auricular hematoma is the accumulation of blood in the suprachondrial space, usually secondary to a blunt trauma to the ear. In order to understand the path of physiology, we must be aware that the cartilage of the penile lacks its own blood supply. The only vascularized portion of the ear is the lobule, so the cartilage relies on the vascularity of the perichondrium attached to it. Now, because of the trauma, there can be an accumulation of blood within this perichondrial space, and the accumulation of blood will create a barrier uh, for the diffusion process between the cartilage and the perichondrial vascularity, and this will eventually lead to the necrosis of the cartilage. Now, the clinical findings that we will see is that the pina can be echematic and edematose, and there can be loss of the normal cartilag uh, cartilaginous landmarks that we usually see on the ear. And we must also know that a failure to evacuate the hematoma may lead to infection, necrosis, and permanent disfigurement of the ear. And this is what we actually know as a cauliflower ear. For the treatment, it's, uh, we have to know that we have to evacuate the hematoma. This is done via incision. Remember that the incision should be no longer than one centimeter. And then we can actually drain the hematoma. Or we can also, depending on the size of the hematoma, we can use a needle and uh, we can aspirate the hematoma. Now, after the evacuation, we use a compression dressing to approximate the perichondrium to the cartilage, and this is in order to avoid the reaccumulation of blood in the ear. Thank you.